Hello everyone, it's Zaid from Zed Security, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix a common issue in Kali where the MAC address automatically goes back to the original one even after manually changing it. So as you can see in here, I've already changed my MAC address to a different MAC address. If you don't know how to do that, then check out the video in the description or on the top left. Now depending on how you're gonna use your interface, sometimes the network manager that comes pre-installed with most Linux distros, including Kali Linux, will reset your MAC address to the original one. So let me show you how to fix that so that even if you go and connect to networks and disconnect and do whatever you want, the network manager would not interfere with the value of the MAC address of your devices. So first of all, I'm gonna clear my screen and I'm gonna use a program called leafpad. So this is just a text editor and I'm gonna use it to open a text file so that I can modify the configuration of the network manager. So the configuration of the network manager is stored in etc, network manager, and it's called networkmanager.conf. So this is a very simple command. We're using leafpad, this is the name of the text editor, followed by the location of the file that we want to edit. And like I said, this is the file that contains the configuration for Kali's network manager. So if I hit enter, you'll see a new text box that contains the content of the file. And all you'll need to do is paste the following lines and I'm gonna include these lines in the resources of this lecture. So you can literally just copy and paste them. Basically what these lines will do, they'll tell the network manager not to interfere with the value of the MAC address and just leave it the way it is. So if we change it, it will not set it back to its original MAC address. Now I'm gonna do Control S to save, Control Q to quit, and we'll just have to restart the network manager for these changes to take effect. So I'm gonna do service network manager restart. And that's it, we're done. And now you can go ahead, change the Mac, use it whichever way you want, and it'll always appear as if it has this spoofed Mac address.